Hey guys, Chris on the BC Gaming here. I teach you guys how to add more RAM into your Minecraft bucket server. So basically, if you guys don't know what RAM is, RAM is basically the memory. So if we're going to be editing the RAM of your server, we're basically editing the memory of your server. So what we are going to be doing is adding more RAM into it. So we're going to be adding more memory into it. So what this does, it would make your Minecraft bucket server um, flow more fluently and it will perform much better than it used to be when you run it normally so what we are going to be doing um, is to edit your application that makes your bucket server start so that will preferably be the bat file you, you created so if you guys want to create a bucket server check in the description for the video or you guys could check out my channel um yeah and the video will be there somewhere um so let's get into it right now so what we are going to do is go to your bucket minecraft server folder so let's go into my one and you guys are going to find the bat folder so you're going to right click that and click edit so what you see here is a java code and if you guys look into the description now you guys are going to be finding three Java codes that look similar to this and they're going to be labeled as 64 bit 32 bit and also Java 7 so uh, what these codes is is a Java code that adds more memory into your server so to find out what kind of operating system you have go to the start menu menu and click control panel find system and where it says the operating uh, the system type and operating system it's gonna say 64 bit or 32 bit so I have a 64 operating system so I'll be using the 64 operating system bit code or the Java code but since I have Java 7 installed to this computer um, I'm going to be using the Java 7 code. So, you guys are going to be copying one of those three codes as you guys are going to replace it with the code you have in the notepad or the one you're editing. So, we delete that and then we're going to paste the new code. So, let's just explain the code for a moment. So, how it works basically is that by default, guys, you guys should be running your Minecraft servers at one gigabyte um, so one gigabyte is alright for around two or three people depending on your net or your internet and how fast it is but if you guys would want to make your server run more smoothly um, you guys are going to boost it up to around two gigabytes or maybe even three so the numbers and the letters you see here xmx2g this is basically the RAM of your Minecraft server so as you can see here it says two gigabytes the code that you pasted in it's, it's going to say two gigabytes by default um, so two gigabytes is more than enough and it will make your Minecraft server more efficient so if you guys were wanting to boost that up you guys could boost that up to three gigabytes depending on how much RAM you have in your computer so I like to stick with two because two is more than enough as I said before um, so 2 gigabytes you could run it around 4 or 5 people I don't know something like that depending on your internet but my internet is pretty shitty so it's not that great but I like to host Minecraft servers so yeah I like playing with friends stuff like that so if you guys would like that experience to be a little bit more like fun you guys could um, decrease the lag by adding more RAM into it so if you guys enjoyed this video, um, give a rating, a like, and maybe uh, maybe even a uh, subscribe. So if you guys found this helpful, um, I hope you guys enjoy. So this is Chris on the BC Gaming signing out, guys. Um, and you guys will be probably seeing some plugin videos that are promised um, for the bucket server videos. I haven't, I know I haven't done that yet, and I promise I will do. Um, I will do that with a friend. So. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Chris on the BC Gaming, guys, signing out. Peace.